Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Grafana 11 Enterprise Edition on Windows 11 operating system. Go to Grafana official website that is grafana.com. Click on Docs, then scroll down, click on Install Grafana, then see here Supported Operating Systems, Debian, Red Hat, Suzu, Mac OS and Windows. And hardware requirements are 512 memory and one CPU. Supported databases are, see these are the supported databases. If you want to install any one of them, you can install by searching my YouTube channel and install them. And supported web browsers. Okay, these are all fine. Now, click on Windows. Click on Navigate to Grafana Download page. Right click on it. Open link in new tab. See, the latest version is 11. We have two types of editions. Enterprise and OSS. We are going to install Enterprise Edge. Scroll down. Then we have to select the Windows. Then click on Download the Installer. See, download has been started. And its size is 166 megabytes. Wait until download completes. See, download is completed. Click on this Grafana Enterprise 11. MSI file. Click on it. Click on next. Select I accept the terms in the license agreement and click on next. If you want to change the, see, this will be the location of Grafana installation. Okay. I am okay with this one. Click on next. Click on install. See, Grafana Enterprise Setup completed. So, click on Finish. Now, we have to connect to Grafana Console. Open New Tab. Then, go to Localhost. Then, Port Number 3000 and hit Enter. See, this is the Grafana Login Console. The default username is Admin and Password also same. Hit Enter. Now, we have to provide the new password for the user Admin. You have to remember this password. Confirm the password and click on submit. See, this is the Grafana console. If you want to see the dashboard, see. We don't have any dashboard. If you want to create new dashboard, you have to click on create dashboard. Or click on this drop down and select the new dashboard. Connections. See, these are the list of the available data sources. Suppose if you want to connect MySQL, click on the MySQL, search for MySQL and click on MySQL. Or else if you want to Connect process equal, click on process equal, then click on add new data source. See, this is the name for the process equal data source. Now, here we have to provide the connection information like URL or IP and port number, database name, username, password, and other options. After that, you have to click on this save and test. Click on MySQL. See, this is the default one. Database name after schools. I have the database name after schools. Then provide the password. Then click on save and test. So let us provide the password. Click on save and test. See database connection okay, which means we have successfully connected. Now, next you can start visualize data by building a dashboard. If you want to restart service, go to services.msc. Go to G. See here we have the Grafana service. If you want to stop, you have to click on stop. Or right click and click on the stop. Or select the stop button. All three options are same. See now service, is, service status is blank, which means it is stopped. Now if you reload this page, we cannot connect will throw error see cannot reach this page okay so select the service and click on the start button or click on the start or right click and select the start all three options are same click on it now 
reload this page see we are able to connect okay if you want to restart the service right click on select the restart so in this video we have seen how to download and install grafana enterprise 11 on windows 11 operating system for more grafana videos please subscribe my channel thank you